What is a blog? Originally created from the words web and log, a blog is just that. A blog is the logging of one's thoughts, ideas, experiences, and more, all in one place on the web. If you're like me, you actually didn't know that. You also might not know just how popular blogs are. What's significant about the number 600? That is how many people will start a blog by the end of this video, about one every half second. As of 2013, there were 152 million blogs. That's a lot of blogging. And if you are like a lot of other people, you may be asking, oh yeah, blogs. What are they about? Just this is real life. This is real life blogging right here. <laughs> interrupting. Blogs take on a lot of different personalities. Take Christian, for example. She is a ball of joy, and her creative lifestyle blogging reflects that liveliness. Or there is Quinn. If you've come to this video to learn about the features or user interface of Apple Watch, you are in the wrong place. Because I'm here to answer one question, and one question only. Is Apple's new Apple Watch worth the $350 plus dollars that Apple asked for? I submit that it isn't. It's fair to say he has a more serious approach to his reviews. So what is all this blogging about anyways? These are the top 15 blogs in the whole world. You may actually follow some. Billions of people come here to find news, entertainment, trending topics, do-it-yourself projects, reviews, sports, and business tips. Why do you follow blogs? The 29% of you who said you did were looking for things like fashion and politics. And 71% think you don't follow a blog. But do you recognize this? So why do people blog? Well, there is some money to be made. 10% even make enough to support a family. And like it wasn't ever originally supposed to be like a business for you, right? It was just, no. yeah, you no, never thought. I heard that some people like made money doing it, but mm -hmm. even then like I was thinking like $100 a month. Yeah. <laughs> nothing like what it really is. And um, even now, people are still floored. And they say, oh, I heard you have a blog. And they'll say, do you make money doing that? And I'm just kind of like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, like it's a full-fledged business. And people are just floored, especially men. Mm -hmm. Power to you if you're one of the lucky 10%. But millions continue to blog even though they don't make a penny. Just take a look at the blog activity around the world. Back in 2012, 25 billion blog pages were being viewed each month. Look at them go, lighting up the world like a Christmas tree. Who was actually interested in blogging? 86% of the people said women were the blogging champions. Turns out, they're right. Women are more likely to have their own blog, follow a company blog, follow a celebrity blog, and maintain more social media profiles. But blogging isn't just for women, oh no. There are many blogs about sports, finance, gear, and technology. Are blogs actually trustworthy? The majority of people don't think so. So our objective from day one has been to bring the most honest reviews to the net. So the companies that send us their products to review do so free of charge. Um, they don't pay us money over or under the table. Um, and then we kind of just tell them up front that we're going to do an honest review. There are credible sources. Just blog with caution. Blogs have grown to mean so much. They become the fifth estate of government, a lifestyle coach, a trustworthy review, and even an online friend. So blog on. <laughs>